Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode here in Passive Skin. It's absolutely a pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us today. We're going to be playing Death Road to Canada. I have heard, I've seen trailers. I have heard of Death Road to Canada a number of times previously. It's a Oregon Trail or Oregon Trail, which was the, um, the zombie version of it. But Oregon Trail with um, a cutesy and creaturey and monstery kind of like design to it. I am looking forward to checking this out. It's um, it's such pixelated zombie madness underneath. Um, Death Road to Canada from Mad Garden and Rocket Cat Game. What's the unlocks? Oh, so you actually unlock stuff. Oh, Alright, so you have to you have zombie points and you spend them on each person that actually goes along here. Oh, okay. Okay. It's cool, cool music. And it's all stats and stuff. Okay. Combat either. Smashing! Fighting! There we go. There we go. So I'm assuming this was actually me choosing the unlocks. I want to actually know how I get back to the game. I was kind of being nosy, just. That's what you do. Oh, that's a pause button. That's why. Scratch screen glitch. Alright. Okay, controls. That's important. Up, left, down, right. Use attack. Alright, attack. Use block. I gotcha. Yes, we're going to the title screen. Starting the game! Oh, this is two player? Oh, dude. Dude. I want to play this multiplayer. Third person with us? Okay. I think she needs to pick up a weapon. Ah, oh, where the weapons go? Ah. Ah, okay, that's cool. So I can drop it so that they can pick it up. Angelia, Angelia, Angelia sees Noble, who is a real dink. <laughs> you dink! When the group finds a zombie bunker, Noble called dibs on this big bedroom before anyone else. Leave him be for now. Call him a dink. <laughs> Everybody from morale increased for calling Noble a dink. <laughs> Oh, that was worth it. Yeah, dink. Die, ah. oh, zombies! Two. 
Get the fuck out of here! Story for Angelia. What? Okay. Um, in tutorial. All right. Oh, so that was the end of the. T okay. You oh, custom characters. Interesting. All right. We'll try a new game first. Oh shit! No. Uh, I have no idea who I'm playing as. It rumors that Canada is a safe place for you to out of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around Florida, Jason braves the death road and travel north. Many bandits can be bought off with food. Some bandits can be beaten by a specific personality type. Read another hint. Before they can damage you, run away to break free. Alright. Okay. To start the journey, the group decides to grab some supplies from a nearby location. In order to survive death road, you'll need to hoard as many supplies as you can. You also need to find ways to train and grow your team. Um, Galmart? Go and bargain hunting.
I am being absolutely silent here, folks, because this one of those things where this game just kind of like just involves you in. Um, Audio-wise, I got I love the soundtrack. The soundtrack is just kind of like dribbling along. I enjoy the beat to it. It's actually kind of fun. Uh, it's got me much more lighthearted than I expected in a zombie survival story. That's everything I need to grab. Um, I am going to go and jump back in the car. Let's get the hell out of here. Wow, the car got beaten up there. I didn't know you had to actually like grab the car to get it started up. Okay, so we got more than we needed. Uh, plenty of rifle ammo, pistol ammo, uh, medicals, uh, gas, got plenty of food as well. Boom. Oh, four food eaten. Uh, there's a moose outside the camp. It looks injured. Just glaring at the group. Even injured, a moose is a really powerful creature. Probably best not to mess with it. Oh, God, this is going to go bad. Ah! <laughs> oh, God damn it. Things like a hard kick to Asara. <laughs> nice. Uh, pff, convenience mark. Probably gonna be the best bet. Just move fast, move fast, move fast. In and out, move through. Get grab things you need, get the hell out of there if you don't need it. Oh shit! Ah crap. House has nothing, house has nothing. Thank 
Boom, we're out of there. Woo! That was actually a profitable actually little trip. I got it. I got into that one. Yeah, so plenty of pistol ammo, rifle ammo, shotgun ammo, uh, more medicals, plenty of gas, and uh, more food. Boom. Happy days. Ready to rock and roll. Mr. Tuners. <clears throat> Yeah, repair and find you in the car for three days. Yeah, sadly not, the car can't go any faster. Nah, I just go to sleep. No point. Hmm. Oh, crawls into the tank? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Leave the pumps the fuck alone. Plenty of gas. Gas is not the problem. Food is the problem. Yep, need to trade for food.
Right, so that's pretty that's pretty much all ready up. Um, I don't want to give up any more fuel, but we've got 13 days before we get there. Hopefully we've got enough to actually... <laughs> We've got enough food for a day and a half, I suppose. Alright, let's try and find a faster car. I'm sorry, Gian, we just don't have the food. Oh, are you kidding me? Dead. Oh man, I feel so bad. She's dead. Let's go run over some zombies with the car. Sure, Daryl. Morale, random skill gain. Um. Healed. I don't know. Uh, morale and random skill gain. Morale and random skill gain. Is it shooting increases? <laughs> Fuck. I ran out of bolts. But I've got plenty of food. Uh, so long the road that looks good for camping as any. Eats a decent meal. Yeah, so I'm solo as it is now. But. A lot cleaner than they should be. <laughs> I'm to go and fight something. Yeah, I'm gonna drive around more because I've got plenty of gas. Secure junkyard? Which for me. Oh, I lost the grenade. Ah, balls.
Maybe the preppers were onto something after all. Maybe that's right. Oh, oh, dude. He's not happy because there's nobody left to talk to. That's true. Make her the weapon. Darl should bark you. Oh, damn. No, Daryl, no! No, Daryl! Oh, man. Ah, uh, fuck. Right, we'll go to the bar. And it's time to actually... We're going loud. We're going loud just because I have to. Oh, shit, fuck it. anybody if I have to because they're just going to actually start horse swarming me if I do many people. <laughs> right, so at least I got some medical supplies, shotgun ammo, more food. Treated all my wounds. Happy days. So it cost me three medical supplies to do that. Oh, God damn it! Right, fuck it. Daryl, you're an asshole. 
Oh, I feel horrible. <laughs> That's a terrible thing to do. I feel like I'm actually just a steal from an injured person, but yeah. It would be great if we were in a tank. Oh, the car needs to be repaired. Well, like tomorrow. The car needs repaired. The car needs repaired. Door alone, you dinks. I'm not a dink! Woo! Oh, damn it. Ryan's a dick. He's gonna eat all my food. Daryl's a bit of an asshole <laughs> as well. Oh, fuck. Um. Packed grocery store. Fuck it. If Ryan dies, he dies. Alright, Ryan, what you got? Oh, <laughs> that, that katana is going into my fucking hand. <clears throat> and you're getting the knife. <laughs> yeah, yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Daryl is already stealing your gear, dude. Right, and I've got that as my backup if I need to. BD stare. Right. Also said she looks like Daryl, but with a ginger beard. <laughs> That's the problem. I think it's actually me. Let's boogie, fucker. Taku fucking thing is shit. Oh, you fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> I am out of here. Feels good. <laughs> Lift the tree. Take a detour. Oh, dude. That's awesome! 
We got a hybrid. Oh, God damn it, girl. Hey, drive the signal. Awesome! Yeah, so I actually found food, medical supplies. That is well worth it. Boom! All, all good. Everything is good. Oh, visit trader camp. Sweet. I've got plenty of food too. Any gas? I'll come back to you, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. A minigun that has a scope, at least we say it's not that's good. Um, I don't, uh, shotgun. A uh, shotgun would be nice. You know what, actually? Give me a shotgun. I do actually need it. I've got the push shells for it. for now. Fuck you, man. <laughs> I'll come back to you. Oh, man. So many sad, sad stories there. Wait, what is this I'm carrying? Oh, it's a rifle. Yeah. I need gas, don't I? Probably do need gas. Good damn food. Better to have the gas than to not. <laughs> oh, I think I've said you just gone all guns. Yeah, I'm fine with that. All right, let's rock and roll. Nine days, I've got to survive. Only nine more days. Need more looting to do more shooting. That's true. Oh, why? Why? Why, Daryl? Why? Why would you do this? Oh, God damn it.
Why would you climb into the sewers? Oh, what kind of fool? Fucking hell, why, Daryl? Why did you do that to yourself? Better have actually died, done it without any incident. Jesus. Daryl finds a candy bar inside the of the road. It's fun sized! Uh, Daryl? CF house, my opinion. Alright, I need to actually pick up a new... I need to pick up, like, some fucking weapons because I have got nothing in hand here. I need something that I can actually beat with. That's boogie. Jesus. Sweet fuck all here. That's good. Fucking shells. Food's always good. Room's a good start. Anything's better than nothing. There ain't nothing safe about this place.
Time to get the fuck out of here! Right, let's see. Back in the car. Back in the car. Boom! Out of the way! With plenty of food, plenty of gas, some medical, plenty of bullets, all good and grand. Happy day! Seems to be an old repair shop with busted machinery laying around. Uh, yeah, tinker all night. Alright, should I... It's actually showing like mechanical is going up, but can I not get it to the point where I can repair my car? Then it does not look well. Pathetic gear, okay. Fly through a car. Yep, back on foot again. <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen. <gasps> oh. Well, at least I got food. Kidding me? Mm. Yes. All right. I was hurt, but I survived. I'll fix this. I'll fix this. No. No. God damn it, Daryl. Yeah, screw it. We're taking the car. I got plenty of gas, but I just don't have the medical supplies. God, it's going to be so busy in there. This hunting lodge. Uh, the fact that it's flashing. Alright, do you know what? Maybe this is the end of Daryl's trip. We're going to the hunting lodge. Mega cheesed. Uh oh. Oh no. Okay. So we need all of the guns <laughs> um and i got, don't have very much health left all right screw it we're ready to rock and roll that's fucking boogie
Hey there, super cheese doll fall zombies. I don't give a shit because I've got all of the gun. Zombies dying. Look, some food got. Pistol ammo, plenty of it got. I need to trade some of that pistol ammo. I used up all of the shotgun ammo while I was there, just. <laughs> you aggressive son of a bitch, Daryl. Oh, dude. gas either but I do need medical supplies uh, does he mind if I break open a couple of boxes oh. Oh, very nice oh nice that's a nice touch ruined camp and I've been invaded by zombies I like that. Oh! Here, fuck you! Damage in my car? What the fuck? Could probably go dumb with the gas. Prepper cabin? Look for me. Uh, we'll put you up top. There's one more bullets for my. Rifle than I have for my shotgun. That's boogie. No! No! Oh! No! <laughs> Damn it! I died in the death route again. I should, I was like, too ballsy. I had no health. I literally walked in and was like, "Fuck!" Down, fell to the floor. Oh man, I should use the shotgun to clear the space first. So I didn't remember to use the rifle. I didn't think. But I have died on the death road to Canada. Um, yeah, guys, this game is fucking amazing. So much fun. Uh, I really recommend it. Also multiplayer, uh, so you have two-player co-op to go along with this. Essentially, okay, you're traveling with your friend, your other player friend can play because whoever it is is traveling with you. You try and gather a group of people, you have to worry about food supplies, you end up being one person, you're all on your own. You have to gather all the stuff to protect yourself. I, that, that was that was a fun experience. Um, I, I loved uh, Oregon Trail and Oregon Trail. Oregon Trail whenever I was a kid. I love this concept, I love this design. It was very well tongue-in-cheek designed. Uh, the monsters are actually creepy enough. The game is cutesy enough. I highly, highly recommend jumping into Death Road to Canada. That was a lot of fun. I want to actually get somebody in to sit down and play this with. 
more than anything else. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. This has been Death Road to Canada here on Passing Chip Skin. It's been an enjoyable experience playing through this game, and I hope you actually all check it out yourselves as soon as humanly possible. God damn, that was so much fun. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you're actually watching this on YouTube, there will be a whole box appearing on the side right next to where it says Death Road Ganda. One of them will be the most recent videos on the channel. Another one will be actually the videos that are on the, this playlist. Another one will actually be a video that's recommended just for you. Based on the user analytics and the things you do on YouTube, it will pick a video that you will like that I have made that will be perfect for you to watch right now. So I highly recommend you click on that one. And I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.